we have 3.3 volt. The bias received 3.3 volt. This is good. 5 volt. We have 5 volt in the USB connector. Hi, my friend. So, welcome again with another amazing, very beautiful laptop that I'm going to check right now. Basically, the failure for this laptop. So, if we plug the adapter, guys, here, yeah. let's plug the adapter. Let's press the power button. Okay, the light comes on. Okay, my friends, here we have the light for charging nice but the screen a black screen my friends nothing in the screen black okay black screen nothing in the screen as you can see so let's figure out what is the problem let's check the it could be the memory i don't know but let's see it could be the bios also if the bios is corrupted so let's check my friend okay okay let's begin let's remove the battery okay seems good battery nice okay nice battery here basically this is for the ram let's find out first guys let's just check the ram and then switch on the laptop and let's see if the something is displayed in the screen if not we're gonna continue uh, disassembling the laptop so let me just clean the RAM guys let's clean the RAM my friend also let's clean the RAM slot also try to clean the RAM slot also here like this it could be the problem dust could be the problem my friends nice let's check it out connect the ram nice okay let's find out my friends let's connect the adapter okay okay here press on button check if we have something in the screen okay let me make like this nothing in the screen my friends so the laptop charging we have all here but the screen is black it could be the bios it could be the ram but we check the ram let's find out my friends here i have basically the hdd the hard disk drive okay hard disk drive here Nice. I have a screw here. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon for anyone who wants to accelerate learning. You can join me in my Patreon page, join me in my Facebook group, check my website, all link in the description. Good. Okay, guys, now we're gonna remove all screws here and then get. To access to the motherboard and check it out of course if we can find the problem okay let's do it nice my friend we're gonna remove the keyboard okay my friends let's find out we are now in the motherboard my friends this is awesome now we are in let's find out the problem first we have to check the display connector okay let's check the display connector first my friends the first thing so, so the display connector seems to be good okay here basically this is the circuit the display connector circuit seems good and the components are good let's do a visual inspection over here okay my friends and basically you have the bios this is the bios my friends let's find out if the bios is fitted with 3.3 volt this is the super io here okay let's check 
Okay, guys, let me connect to adapter. Good. Okay, I need the power button here. Okay, I have the power button here. Okay, so I should connect this cover. Let me connect the cover again, guys. Let me connect the cover, switch on the laptop, and then remove the cover. So let me connect the cover, switch on the laptop, and then remove the cover. So I connect, press on, laptop is on. Now I will remove the cover. Okay, the laptop is on. Okay, my friend, the laptop is on. The multimeter to 20 volts. Okay, let's check. Let's find out if the BIOS received 3.3 volts. The black probe here in the ground. Here are the BIOS, the pin number 1. Let's check the pin number 8. We have 3.3 volts. The BIOS received 3.3 volts. This is good. Nice. Where is the 3 volt, 5 volt circuits? The uh, calls in the other side. Okay. Everything seems to be good. Let's check this capacitor for USB connector. If it receives 5 volt. Okay. 5 volt. We have 5 volt in the USB connector. Means the 3 volt and 5 volt are good. Okay, my friends. Once we find 5 volt here. New USB connector means 5 volt is good. Once we find 3.3 volt here in the BIOS, means 3.3 volt is good. So the 3.3 volt and 5 volt uh, circuit are good. Okay. Okay, my friends. So I should go to the other side. So nothing in the in the display. I should I should remove the motherboard and check out. Check it out the other side, my friends. The byte, let's check. It could be the RAM, yes. It's nice, nice, nice. Nice. This is okay. okay. The laptop is on. Laptop comes on, friends, as you can see. So, thank you very much, my friends. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and hit the bell.